Hey guys, welcome back to The Wandering Wind here on YouTube. And today I wanted to talk a bit about, um, well, something I wasn't expecting to have to talk about, but here it is. I got scammed on eBay. Now, this may have nothing to do with the company itself. It may just be that something happened during shipping or whatever. But I ordered about two, three weeks ago this gaming motherboard for a new build for a client. Well, not for a client, just to be able to sell. Really, I haven't been able to make any, like, person-to-person -person, um, connections for clients or anything in a while. But, you know, you open up the box, you get the thing out, and it's just... You know, it's just this. It's the motherboard and the CPU. Bog standard motherboard, you know. Um, it's an X99 chipset, so it's actually based on a Xeon processor, right? So it's older technology. This is what I have in my current system right now. It's an X99 system that I also got overseas. This came from China. The problem is, I bought this, I tried to test it out, I had every single possible possible troubleshooting step put together, this thing will not power on. I have looked and tried to find a possible reason why it doesn't work, and I have yet to find one. However, that's not the real issue, you know. I could handle, you know, I could handle just there not being a, a good product and maybe something happened. What I can handle is this, all right? I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to switch over for a second to a screen cap for just a second, all right? I'm going to take, uh, dang it. All right, well, I guess I'm going to have to drag this window over. All right, let's see. I'm going to take a look at this listing with you and tell me if there's anything interestingly off about it, all right? So here's the order I placed, you know, $66.36 sold by AIM Retail or I'm Retail or something or other. All right, so if I click on the listing here, and I try and go to it. It says that this page is missing. All right. Weird. All right. So, all right. Let's go to the sellers page. No longer a registered user. And so this kind of makes me think this is a bit more than just a bum product than just a, a, a one-off thing. Because it's one thing, because I've had bad orders before. I've had bad products before. I've gone through through eBay. I've managed to get my money back. It's all worked out. This time around, there's no one to go to. There's no one to say, hey, your product came in and it doesn't work. Can I, you know, nothing. So unless I can get eBay to refund me, which maybe they will, maybe they won't. I'm out $66 because of a scam, all right? And, you know, you might tell me, well, Gregory, why didn't you think of this before you looked? I did all my research, and everything I could see said that this was going to be a safe buy. Everything I could see, everything. I mean, I looked at all the... All the um, specs and everything i tried to make sure that i matched up yes it wasn't exactly a big account i thought okay some guy is just selling things one off when they can like i do all right and granted they may be from china but that's okay i i wouldn't mind shipping to other countries too if someone were to buy a product overseas and i could have it shipped i've done that before actually once but you know even once was enough um, but, you know, I thought to myself, okay, 
what do I do now? Because not only do I have other parts that I have nowhere to put, I mean, I've got this GTX 970 non-TI version. I'm going to do a video about it because I think it for, I think it probably does get need a video of its own. But I got this to put in it. I got a set of RAM. I got a, an SSD for everything I, I needed. I put in there nothing because the mother the motherboard is crap. So, you know, I'm just kind of <laughs> I'm kind of over it, you know. And, you know, I should have said something to myself about it because um, the branding on it, on the on the motherboard itself, is ZSUS. It's not ASUS. It's literally ZSUS or ZSUS for you youngins out there because, you know, everything has to be sus. Everything has to be, you know, so-so because what what's that game that you guys play the uh, these days? Um, uh, Among Us? Yeah. <laughs> I don't play video games that often. The new video games that often. I play older stuff. The only new stuff I play is Genshin Impact, Ankai Star Rail, and Weathering Waves. That's it. So, as far as the Among Us stuff, I don't get it. But, you know, I'm just kind of... Eh. I'm just kind of overall... done with... Chinese stuff, you know? So I think from, from now on, I'm going to buy brands I recognize. Brands I know. Brands that I can trust. Because honestly, you know, it might not... If I can't get anything from, you know, eBay about getting a refund, then I might as well just say goodbye to the money. So, um, you know, there's that. By the way, um, if you guys want to help me recoup my loss in the meantime, there is a, a, a coffee link down below that you can directly donate to. I don't care if you do. I don't care if you don't. I'll make the money back somehow. I'll find something I can sell. Heck, I could sell my printer. Nah, I don't sell my printer. It's useful. Um, but I could probably sell some stuff and gain 20 bucks. Eh. You know, I just... I... <laughs> I thought, oh, this is a great deal because, you know, normally I'd be paying 60 bucks for the motherboard and then another 40 to 60 bucks for a CPU if I wanted something about about this range of performance. So I'm like, $66 and 30 some cents, not a bad idea. And, yeah, well. So I'm just kind of done. I kind of got screwed. I kind of got scammed. You know who else is getting scammed? Your wallet. <laughs> the taxes these days is ridiculous. And the prices of stuff these days. It's horrible. But anyway, that's all I had for today. I wanted to just share a bit about what I'm going through. Um, hope you guys are having a happy Saturday night. And I'll see you guys again next time. Here on The Wandering Wind. Take care. I'll see you soon.